to Fort Worth we go. OU taking on TCU. The Sooners had lost five straight games heading into this one. First half, Christian Doolittle was cooking. How about the 17-foot jumper in your face? Yup. How about the elbow step back jumper? That'll go down as well. Then Doolittle goes to the post. We'll hear more from him later. His dad and his brother in attendance today and loving it. And there's Long Kruger talking to the team and Christian James making up his mind saying, it's, it's my turn to dominate. So he did second half. He finds Brady Manick for three. Then the next possession down the floor, Manick gives it to James who hits it for three. Then Christian James again drawing attention. He finds Mr. Manick for three. 14 points and five assists for James today. Two minutes left, OU up six. I told you you'd see more Christian Doolittle, so here it is. Puts the game away with the floater. The family loves it. He finishes with 21 points and 10 rebounds, five assists as well. OU beats TCU 71-62 for their first win since January 26th versus Vanderbilt. The next take on Texas in a week. Long Kruger, how you feeling? on to the Cowboys of Oklahoma State really struggling have lost their last seven conference games heading into this one versus Texas and Thomas Desagua had himself a day. How about seven threes? So we'll show them all to you. That was the first one from straight away. Then number two, off the curl. Yep, that goes down. Then the third three from straight away, deep again. Four will come off the steal right here. Step back, transition three, are you kidding me? He'll make it five three-pointers on the left wing. Then in the corner for six. Ladies and gentlemen, he still has not hit the rim. All swishes. Then number seven just fires away for three. That would make it a six-point game with just under nine minutes left. Desagua doesn't hit another three the rest of the way, and the Cowboys lose to Texas 69-57, 23 for Desagua. It's OSU's eighth straight Big 12 loss.